Hi Virgo, welcome to your weekly forecast and this is for July 15th until 22nd. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Oh, Virgo. Good news that's going to be coming your way. It just I feel like you're going to be very happy about it, but you are going to be acting a little bit too high. Okay? And proud. Alright, let's take a look at your health situation. Well, at least Virgo, you're going to be, you know, you're going to try and get back in shape. And I feel like uh, emotionally you're going to be finding some comfort. And I feel like you'll also be driven to improve your appearance or your, your body. Or try to get back in shape because of someone that you're with. I'm not saying that it's also, it's because of the insecurities, but you want to impress this person about, you know, that you're still, even though of age, you're still, hmm, you could still appear more alluring. And you won't fail because this person will be satisfying you this week. It's just that I feel like you're also aiming for somebody outside your relationship or there is someone Who's standing as a temptation? Soulmate. Wow. Looks like this is really the right one for you, eh? Okay, give your relationship a chance. Some Virgos will try to opt to go back to um, media industry or to... Um, communications related jobs or uh, line of work oh this just keeps on coming up to a very ill all right now, as I've said, that there will be very good news that you're go that's going to be coming your way. You'll be very happy that, oh my God, you know, finally it's here. But don't be so proud. You know, keep your feet on the ground that even though there is like an achievement or something that you've been waiting for and finally you've already achieved it. Because if you will have the wrong kind of attitude, it might just slip off your fingers up to the last minute. The energy could change. Anything could happen, you know, up to the last minute. So try to have the right attitude for that. <clears throat> and again, don't celebrate too much or don't rejoice too much because this, you know, I just said it, you know, things could actually slip away out of your fingers up to the last minute. So it's going to be a, a big ordeal for you to change some of your attitudes or some of your behaviors. But one thing is for sure is that there is a, a very good news that's related to communications, money, opportunity, work, or contract that's going to be coming your way. Now, some Virgos who's actually thinking of changing their jobs or who is not really contented with how their work is going right now or their business, you are thinking of going back into the field of communications. And I feel like you want to study something. I'm also picking up something in the 
like linguistics or language or learning new language or something like that and um, I feel like hmm, I feel like you'll be able to get a break from this but I, uh, I don't feel like this is the right kind of work for you okay there's something that you'll be achieving and uh, be successful from it so things will be calling out for some changes okay or shift now when it comes to your health you're gonna be you're you want to go back in shape or you want to get back in shape try to tone down your muscles your skin and your body and I feel like you'll also be very concerned about your you know how you look like your hair your skin and how you appear in front of other people so there will be a shift of personality not just not just your appearance it's like you're gonna be changing altogether just because of a break or just because of something that recently come your way and you feel like this is a you know like a, like an opportunity okay that other people that cannot have or doesn't have or that you cannot achieve in your everyday life so try not to be so pompous about it all right now when it comes to your sex life the one that you want to seduce or the one that you want to display your your beauty or you know whatever it is right in front of you or outside of you you will be successful in getting that person's attention because definitely they're gonna be wooing you and you're they're gonna try and satisfy you sexually this week now only you have the key because I feel like you're still attracted to somebody outside of your relationship which is a fire sign now while you are trying to woo this other person you are thinking of somebody else or you are going to be seeing someone else or your partner will be seeing someone else while you are in the process of wooing each other all right and there will also be some jealousy a confrontation plus revelation so i feel like there will also be a comparison now be very careful if you've been together for such a long period of time because mostly if you've been together for a long period of time then what the other is doing then you will also be doing and vice versa all right and you will eventually have that big confusion or big, uh, what do you call this, um, insecurities, okay? So if you don't want to waste this opportunity, this happy opportunity that you're in, try to think long and hard about entertaining somebody outside of your relationship, okay? finances and career it seems like you need to make a choice okay the one that you're with is already your soulmate to so give this person a chance or give this relationship a chance but don't let your love life or don't let your emotions run over you and you still have other important things to do in your life aside from being like a lovesick puppy okay now travel is uh, is also very imminent here now, to of Ariel, it's important to have balance, working multiple jobs or projects at once, and making work fun. Ten of Ariel, oh, this is family. There is so very much to be grateful for, a financial success and promise of retirement and a rich and rewarding family life. Ace of Raphael, a positive new emotional experience, fulfilling romantic relationships, deep and lasting spiritual insights. As I've said, keep your feet on the ground, and everything could change up to the last minute if you don't have the right kind of attitude to be successful, all right? So anyway, that's it for you for this week, Virgo. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live video readings, just go and visit me at my website. It's sophiaangel.net. And please take note, I don't accept, um, I don't accept any bank transfers or wire transfer payments for my reading. I only accept PayPal uh, payments, okay? So have a great week and blessings to you.